Look at my match show right here, and we'll be talking about Static Online with another talk about picking your faction. Um, this really needs to we really need to get some, some terminology first. Uh, here's some terms: Allied faction. It really means the, act, the faction you've chosen to join. This really means that means it for Romulans. It means it's your your federation or your K KDF. Cross faction flying. The ability f for a f Federation captain to fly a KDF ship and vice versa. This technically extends to the Allied to the Romans when flying the Allied faction ships or not Allied faction ships. Federation. This actually is a group term for the 249 and TS the original series and Discovery era Federation starship Starfleet characters. That you had the, the introduction we have been having uh, 249 the series on Discovery. We quite often start turning this to Fed Fed and Starfleet so is considered the military arm of the Federation and it's for that. So the play, this more content you can play alone. Most of the vid videos is actually is based on this solo content. Now, the two missions we need to be aware of is the turning point and turn the tide. T the turning the point is from is, pa is part of the Roman storyline, and turn the tide is part of the Dominion storyline. Story Both these missions have an important player choice to join to join the Federation and Starfleet. Or join the Klingons with with their the Klingon Defence Force. This is choice affects is for the rest of the rest of the lifetime of this character. There is no redo. I've got to stress that. And to continue with the story, you must pick one of these options. While both missions can be replayed, you cannot choose the other faction on a on a replay. You have to. You'll be forced to. Skip the skip the choice, or just basically you will be forced to click the same choice again. Remaining neutral is not an option. Many players that have tri tried to play tried to play on have tried access to many features that have just been just flat out broken or just locked behind out of standard features. This commonly include no account bank mail or exchange access and limited star access. You have very few means to actually level up and you're actually most likely to be locked out of most if not all group content. You can only replay dishes as a Romulan or you'd be stuck inside turn the tide as a Dominion character. But the really big question is which side you'd be picking, so which side's better? That's the pros and cons for picking the Federation or that's K KDF. The some pros and cons were eliminated based on actions actions with other characters on the same account. The Romulan storyline does not deviate significantly depending on which faction you, cho you choose. The, the story has only has you for picking. Uh, Sorry, it's only you pick pick if you if you see it. So some 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 additional things to know. Both the Roman and Dominion captains are generally treated as a member of the Allied faction for most thing, things. In more, a Federation Roman will have access to most items that a standard Federation captain will have access to. These include paid Zen or ships or. Or uh, even delivery starships, or even even just any other type of most other ships, bridge officers and duty officers, and in, and most well and almost all of the stars, including fleet stars. Only a the, the original series and discovery uh, stars, which are locked to the the relative the the tutorials of the of the respective. Uh, sub faction uh, 
is really the way you can get all of those stars. Roman caps do actually have access to a few Roman Renault exclusive items. These include Roman's Duffs and Duty Officers and British Officers. These are technically a, fed a Federation Captain and a Klingon Captain can, can easily obtain the both of those but cannot use them. As I said, and as I said, you cannot And they can't be used by uh, the. Which I should rephrase that last line. <laughs> but that is what I've just said. But, group play. Roman captains can't play the allied story mission, allied faction story missions. So, nor can a Federation captain or KDF captain can solo a Roman storyline. Now, I will point out you can be invited to, by a. By by one by a Roman captain or a Fed to and or you can invite a Roman captain into a Fed only mission as you can see here. This, believe it or not, is actually one of a few deleted sh missions ble uh, I've got on my got on here, and this is Susanna on from about tw from about about twit. About middle of 20, 20, 20, 40, 40, 2013, I think, or twenty fourteen, where we basically bring in and bring being both carried through with a with a with a Roman captain, and as you can see in the to the centre of that screenshot is Miro Paris with being blonde and short hair, not like as how she is in the. In the uh, in the Iconium one, and staring, looking at her, and looking up, look is Tovan Kev from the Roman storyline in a Federation only storyline. <laughs> nah. so, so let's let's have a quick some cover some what the pros of each faction. Joining the Federation is really the pros, I mean the pros for joining the Federation. Most sea shops, stores, sea star or fleet ships in the game will be are available, will be available, available in the, or one form of the, because most ships have a, a variation of a theme, so most of the themes are actually counted with a Federation only version. Most of the iconic ships in, in the game, in the game and are from the Federation side of things, and quite a few of the Roman ships do have a Federation counterpart. There are a lot more Federation fleets around, and more likely to be to be have got their stores completely opened up for people to buy from. It's also a lot easier for groups to team up and do pre-made group group content, story missions, as shown on the previous. Series slide are TFOs, which, if you especially elite TFOs, which you can only do with pre made groups. In other words, you can't, can't you've got to ask people to join up for you, which wouldn't bad mean people made. However, those are actually the Klingon, also the Klingon disadvantages, but there aren't that many. So, uh, so join the KDF. You you could most of the KDF ships have a cloak, which means that Roman crews can take advantage of the cloaks themselves better than a pure KDF crew can. But they still useful. Many of the there are quite a few iconic KDF ships, and they'll be available. And you'll also have easy access to the KDF only delivering gen delivering generating methods. However. Join the KDF for, as a Roman or a Dominion captain does not open cross faction fl ship flying for hitting level 65. The big question is, which one do you want to do? You go for again, it really, really does not, it really depends. I found that the what's the delithium advantage is that is actually less important today, just the way that. The changes in the game 
it's basically made it it's easier easier to get the lithium and well it's easy, easy to get the lithium on the federation character it's still easier on the, the on the kdf characters if your friends are playing federation characters exclusively or playing federation rumbling characters you may want to go with fed if you want to play with them as for ship choice you know, they with enough time effort time effort or money <laughs> it is possible to unlock cross faction flying either with a pure KDF character getting to level 65 or paying pay with Zen or Zen with Zen either from converted from Delithium or for paying real money. The real question people were asking, what about me? So what about me as me as me as well? I will definitely be picking a side. And I'll be using some one of one of my other three other Romulan characters to show in case any major side between change between factions. This showcase will team with most of the shared missions. This will also be I'll be using Scouts and Tag for their respective missions respective mission factions for their missions. Uh with Merzo and another one of the other pre existing Roman characters for other Roman changes. I won't be releasing listening who Merzo will go with until next week. That is a good reason for subscribing and ringing that bell. And I'm talking about, and I think it's that, with that bell ringing, I think it's time for us to see you guys next time and find out what and come back then and see and see what I'm going to be do which faction I'm going to go with. But so then I'll be my check writer. See you guys next time.